Pull into your parking spots, unbuckle your seatbelts, and silence your car horns because the film is about to begin. But before you do that, you better tune in to the right radio station. The station is 87.9 FM. As a movie lover myself, I'm so excited. Who knew that drive-in theaters would be back in style in 2020? Social distancing isn't all bad. And sometimes, with retroactivities, come new experiences. For many, this is the excitement of pulling up to a huge movie screen and reclining back in the comfort of their own car. I've never been into a drive-in movie, ever in my life, so I'm really excited. At Orangewood Academy, families line up for a movie in the parking lot. Putting the ING in park, this is the City of Garden Grove's way of reimagining what was formerly movies in the park with COVID-19 spacing and safety. Tonight, it's Dora and the Lost City of Gold. I was excited to watch Dora. <laughs> this means a lot just because we finally get to do something together because my husband works all day, so it's like finally a time to be here and then me growing up on Dora the Explorer. It's, it's amazing. On a different night, we find ourselves at Pacifica High School showing the cult classic, The Goonies. It was so much fun and then when I saw this one, I knew we had to come again. I'm just very thankful to Garden Grove to do this. And while the drive-in movie itself is fun, there is an additional perk. Well-being, mental well-being to get out of the house. It's just cool. It's good to actually get out of the house. Yeah. 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 Breathe the natural air. <laughs> <laughs> and in the age of COVID-19, getting out of the house, fresh air, and family time have become more important than ever, which is exactly why the city of Garden Grove is making these nights a priority. We don't get a lot of these times, especially now with everything that's going on. So to have this, it's really, really great. Spend time with the kids, out in the fresh air. Yeah, enjoy family time. To find out more about activities in Garden Grove, please visit ggcity.org. Reporting for GGTV3, I'm Brianna Greenup.